I know that the coronavirus has changed a lot of things that we do daily. It has restricted you from accessing a lot of things, including your uh, doctor. Now that the curve has flattened and the load of cases is dropping dramatically, we feel very safe that patients should actually continue their medical care with their doctors in the outpatient setting and not wait till they are very sick to go to the hospital. So I've seen a few cases where patients wait at home and they ended up with heart attacks and some of them unfortunately did not make it. We don't ever want to see that happening to you. So we have designed a plan in my practice to make it safe for the staff and the doctors as well as the patients to come and see us. And we start with the phone calls, we educate you about symptoms of coronavirus, we ask you about them. And then when you come to the office, we ask that we have one patient at a time, the rest of the patients will wait in the car. We have made a plan not to see more than one to two patients per hour. This is to minimize waiting time uh, in the car or in the waiting room. And we, of course, uh, we want your safety to be our top priority. When you come in, we ask you the same questions again. We take your temperature, make sure there's no fever, and if there's no suspicion that you have any infection, then we see you and we take care of you. It's very important to keep our preventative measures going, okay? So to minimize the chance of any infection, we also ask you to bring a mask, and if you don't, we provide you mask. For example, something like this would be adequate so if two people wear masks, meaning the patient and the doctor or the staff, the chance of getting infection becomes close to zero. This is important for you to know because the last thing I want to know is that you had, God forbid, a heart attack or major problem, heart failure, arrhythmia, anything like this at home, and you are too afraid to come to your doctor or even call the doctor. One more thing, in case that if you can't come to the doctor for whatever reason or you don't feel comfortable, we still do virtual medicine over the phone. We actually do it through video conferencing where you can see the doctor and the doctor see you, or we can do it just over the phone. Bottom line is we want to take care of you at all circumstances and do the best job that we can to keep you healthy. Have a good day.